My name is Raymond Sweeney, and I hail from a little town land called the Farrigans in County Donegal, Ireland. Since I was a young boy, hard work, determination and striving to succeed was engraved into me. Growing up on a farm wasn't easy, but we had to do it to get by. I put my heart and soul into everything I do, and to this day I still have a huge passion for farming. I started going to Irish dance classes in my local village hall at the age of 9. I went on to be a professional dancer at the age of 16, but I knew there was still more I could achieve. It was always in the back of my mind to put together my own production to tour worldwide, but especially America. I wasn't going to do it unless I knew 100% that it was going to be a success. 2012 was the 100th year anniversary of the tragic events of the Titanic. Despite it being such a tragic story, I knew it was one that would captivate people all around the world. I immediately got a team together to help me with this project and I couldn't wait to get started. As we didn't have the money and the facilities to rent a dancing rehearsal room, we choreographed the show in a little prefab at my father's yard. It wasn't ideal, but we made it work. My dad always said to me, you always have to work with what you've got. And that is what we did. Even though we spent long hours with the sweat beating off us, it was fun at times, but a huge, huge challenge. To see it all come together then on the stage was something special. Quite emotional. And that was the beginning of Titanic Dance. Well, when Ray actually mentioned this idea to me, I thought, wow, you know, so ambitious, what a big project to take on. But knowing Ray, I knew that he could do it. Like, when Ray puts his mind to something, he's going to do it, and he's going to do it really well. He came to me uh, when he was putting this show together to ask me would I help him with the music. Um, he knows I've been at music, like, all my life, all my professional life. Um, and he knew I'd be able to put a team together. So we got on board with a young dynamic musician from Mayo called Stephen Doherty. Great flute player, accordion player, composer. He's written new music for this show. And we put together a great team of musicians and put the music to the choreography that Ray and Louise and Jim had put together. I was invited down to see Titanic Dance in a place called Letterkenny in Donegal in early 2014 and I was blown away by the, the production standards. They had some wonderful costumes, great choreography, fantastic music and a wonderful storyline and to be perfectly honest with you it was one of the best shows that we have ever seen uh, and we're so proud to be involved with it now and happy to try and take it to the next level. After performing our shows in the Odyssey Arena in Belfast and here in the Millennium Forum in Derry, we now want to take this show to the next level. We want to go to America. This campaign is going to help us improve our costumes, source out some new talent for the show and provide us with uh, adequate rehearsals time and space in order to get the production exactly how we want it to make this show what we want it to be. And with your help we can do that. This campaign will very much help us, musically speaking, with instruments, also with the standard of musicians that we're going to bring to your country because we want to get the best calibre of musician to travel to your country with this show. And if we can assemble the best team, you're going to get the best show. I sincerely hope that you can help and donate to us, you know, in any way because it doesn't matter if it's $15 or ten thousand dollars you know each and every one is, is special to us and it's going to help us take this show you know to that level that we believe that it can compete with the best out there and we appreciate anything you can do thank you <laughs>